Hey Cancer, thank you guys for tuning in. This is going to be a love reading for you guys. Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Also check your Jupiter, your North Node, with signs in your 7th house. It's not going to resonate with every Cancer. Take what resonates, leave the rest, or take it how it resonates to your life. Ah, flip all the way over. Personal readings in the description box, guys. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. Bear with me, guys. Readings are a little bit off these le these last couple of weeks because I've been a little bit under the weather. All right. Separation comes out. Love yourself first comes out. So, yeah, I've been kind of doing uh, readings sporadically. <laughs> so, Cancer, um, you're leaving someone behind and you're loving you first. Oops, something flipped over. Let your friends help you. And, oh, new love on the bottom of the deck. Yes. <laughs> All right. Um, cancer. Let's see what's going on. Whoa. Y'all just, some of you guys are dealing with a Libra. Um, I'm not going to take all these, but I'll show you guys what flipped over. Uh, two twos back to back. So, a Cancer, are you undecided if you want to uh, reconcile with a someone you're separated from or a new person? Let's see, let's see. Okay, y'all, cards are flipping and the Two of Swords flips over again, you guys. <sighs> Same cards. So here's what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to take these because you <laughs> two of swords, same exact cards flips over. Two of wands, ten of pentacles, and the page of wands. Okay? Seven of cups as well. All right, Cancer, are you exploring your options? I'm seeing a, a flame here. Some of you guys might be involved in a flame. With a fire sign, take it how it resonates, okay? Or you might be meeting someone, uh, someone new. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the high priestess? Ooh. The page of cups. Someone needs to use their intuition. The Seven of Cups again. What the hell? Cancer, are you not using your intuition regarding a situation? Is your intuition blocked or do you feel like it is? Y'all cards are just flipping right on over. Oh my goodness. The Nine of Pentacles, the Three of Swords, and the Star. Yeah, Cancer, you're healing right on up. The Eight of Pentacles on the bottom of the deck. Could be a Virgo, Aquarius, Pisces. All right, Cancer. Um. All right, Cancer. You have a decision to make here, and I feel like you're not sure how to, to go about it. Or what direction you should take. Um, I feel like you don't know if you want to be single or if you want to be in a relationship. Ah! Okay, hold on guys, a car fell on the floor. Yeah, Ace of Swords. You're trying to get some clarity about something. Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn Energy. Ooh, Five of Wands on the bottom of the deck. Yeah, Cancer, that's what I thought. Okay, so... You may have a choice between two new people. I feel like, Cancer, you're afraid to make the same mistake that you made in the past. 
Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. Ooh, the High Priestess again on the bottom, guys. And the Hermit comes out. More Virgo energy. I'll show you guys what came out. Yeah, Cancer. First of all, I feel like you have trust issues. I feel like you have um, other options. Because these, these relationships that I'm seeing are new. You are separated from someone, though. Could be a Capricorn. Um, more than likely three different energies I'm seeing here. Um, it could be two. Take it how it resonates with you, uh, Cancer. But I see that you have a choice between two uh, love interests. And you're not sure if you even want to be bothered at all. I feel like, Cancer, I have to tell you to, to learn how to trust yourself. Because I, I feel like you're afraid of making the same mistake again um, in another connection. <sighs> the Three of Wands. Yep. Um, this person could be at a distance from you. But this is also looking for help. And this is coming up under let your friends help you, uh, Cancer. So your your friends might be giving you advice. You're asking your friends advice regarding this situation when you should really be look, listening to your intuition, uh, Cancer. Although, although, friends' advice, especially if, if, they, if they're well-meaning, we, if I can talk, if they're well-meaning, um, can be extremely helpful. King of Cups, yeah, Scorpio energy, not, yeah. Cancer, you're guarded. Eight of Wands on the bottom, yeah. Cancer, you're extremely guarded, and I feel like it's from a past situation. You went through a situation in the past that um, may have altered the way that you see relationships. Um, and it's not totally bad. It's not a totally bad thing. But I feel like a spirit is telling me to to trust your intuition, Cancer, because I feel like you may have thought of a person you were dealing with was your person, um, Cancer, and it turns out that they're not. And so now I feel like you're kind of um, in your head because you're like, what if I make the wrong choice again? Yeah. You have a great connection here, though, with one of these people, okay? Um, definitely explore your options, because I keep seeing that seven of cups. Definitely explore your options, Cancer, and trust yourself. Trust yourself. That's, that's what I'm seeing. Of course, to love yourself first, okay? Trust that the choices you are making are for your better good and for your highest good. Um cancer because i'm not even really seeing I, i'm seeing a lot of options for you but you're not sure which direction to go you're not even sure if you even want to entertain options you might even want to just be single and work on you know building something for yourself and that's okay too um cancer but what i'm picking up on is a cancer that wants a connection wants love but doesn't fully trust love right now Whoever this new person is, Cancer, is going to be extremely healing for you. If you if you open up to it, because I see you're, you're very guarded with this new person. Could be a fire sign, Scorpio, or Aquarius. Take it how it resonates, um, Cancer. But this person is going to be very, very, very healing from you, for you. This person is going to give you the ability to trust again. Yeah. But you got to be open to it, uh, Cancer. And trust that you're going to make the right choice. You're going to make the right uh, decision. All right, Cancer. To the point, I love it. Thank you for watching, Cancer. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. Peace out.